Menez goes the opposite way. That's a fair ball. Round third comes Juan Lagares, and the 19-year-old shortstop gets the Mets on the board with his second hit of the spring. Fastball belt high up, stayed nice and level, went right with the pitch. Well done. The pitch line to left, and that's going to drop for a base hit. Rolls all the way back down the left field line. Around third, Franco comes in and scores. They're going to wave around Ely. Here's the throw to the plate from Tucker. It's late, and two runs score. Now the throw gets away from Pabst, and Jimenez ends up all the way at third base. A two-run double, and Binghamton has pulled back within a run. The 0-1. Jimenez drives it towards left center. This one a base hit, skipping all the way past Krieger, rolling to the wall. Franco scores around third beyond the he comes in and Andres Jimenez pulls into second with a two run double. The ponies lead three nothing. How about that off the bat from Jimenez? Oh, that was that was hit hard and, and the left fielder was kind of playing him shallow and he didn't have a direct route to cut that off before it got in the alley. And a highly heralded prospect at that out of Venezuela. The Mets trying to bolster their farm system at the trade deadline. You'll see the man on deck, Will Toffee, a product of a trade this year. 1-0 pitches hammered out the right field deep. On the move is Castillo. It'll fly over his head, off the track, and up the wall again. Michael rounds third. He'll head home. And Binghamton, just like that, on back-to-back -back doubles, will take a 1-0 lead here in the first inning. Binghamton not fooled at all by any of Mike Conley's pitches.